Hey Jen. I uh, would love to set up my computer camera because it takes beautiful pictures inside and I can be further away. However, I don't know, something's weird with the upgrade. The software is not working anymore and causes too many problems. And I have to get off to the bank to do other stuff. So anyways, anyways I just want to show you exactly what you're going to be getting and how to open it up, okay? Are you ready? This is it. Look. Gosh, let's just move over here instead of sticking myself in there because I don't need to be there anymore. This is the Futon Kansoki that I got for you. And this is just a little bit of dust here. I cleaned it all off so it looks nice and new and shiny. The stickers are even still on it there. And uh, I'm going to explain the buttons to you very easily and quickly now, okay? This is the one that gives you one, two, three hours. If you, like my just turns it, cranks it way up like this and she lets it go. So then when I get in bed, I nearly die, it's so hot. Uh, the upper side gives you the heat. The lower side gives you just air. So you can, you know, turn it on for like, like this and uh, go about doing your things and stuff like that. And then come back and just shut it off and climb into bed, it'll be nice and warm. This is a little bit of a vent here. This one is for, um, this one is for the, the um, mites and bugs and stuff like that because we have a lot of humidity here and they have a problem with that with little kids and things. But I would just leave it down here, which basically is just um, setting it up to dry. Okay, and they, they say with, with uh, fragrance, but I really don't think it is. So, you're going to have it, and this is basically what it's like. Not a very big thing. And it has a cord, which is down here. You pull it out and you stick it in. Ah, now that what you're going to be doing, my friend, is opening this up like this. And taking this bag out. And then you're going to close it up again. Okay? Now, as you can see, there's a hole here, right? Okay, so you're going to take this and open the bag up to full size. Dum de dum de dum de dum de dum. Like this. Mm -hmm. See? Got it? This is how it looks. Right, all opened up. Uh, stand up here and you can take a look here. You see, and you just lay that in the bed where you would be sleeping. Okay? And then you're going to take this end here and you're going to put it into the hole and using two hands you will push it in there like that. Got it? Very easy, very good. And then you're going to, oops, make sure it's not twisted like this. Just a sec. This is difficult to do with one hand. Okay, and you'll pull the covers back up over over this, okay? And then you will go and plug it in. Uh, see, plug it into the outlet here. Alrighty. And we got it all set up like this. And your bed is all made again. And then you'll just take it and turn it on. And the air goes in and it fills up just like that in between your sheets and if you leave it for 20 or 30 minutes your bed will be nice and warm in the middle of winter when you get in simple clean not overly large but it does an amazing trick i think you like it i really do think you'll like it. Okay, so I'm gonna pack it up now and we're gonna take it to the post office and we'll send it off to you. Let me know when you get it, okay? See ya. Oh, by the way, the uh, the filters that were in here uh, had just sort of turned to uh, powder because believe it or not, this thing is 16 years old. 16 years old. It's pretty cool, I just think for 16 years. Uh, so I made some new ones and I also, I'm just including some more of these sort of 
things in there that you can use or not use in the future if you want to change the filters. But I doubt if you'll need to now for a long time anyways, for a couple of years. So it'll be fine. All right. So we'll be sending those off to you. And see you later. Well, we're at the train crossing now. Right across the street from this is the post office. But we have to wait for the train to cross. And then we move forward and into the parking lot. Traffic, traffic, check both ways, we're okay. Let's just pull in here and go inside. Beep. And here we are at the post office sending Jenny's parcel off to America by EMS. Oh, what else can I say? There you go. And there you have it. It's done. And it should be off and arriving probably Monday or Tuesday, I think. <laughs>